Hello everyone, and this is a crazy free video, and I'll be showing you how to add particles into your level. And as you can see in my level, I've got different part uh, particle that will show um, us water sliding down. I've also used it in here for splashing effects and ripple effects. And over here, I've also used it for for smoke and fire to appear. Now I'm going to do this really quick. In this blank terrain I shall place the particle effect which is under the roller bar and T and is under the particle. And drag and drop the particle effect making sure that the terrain button is clicked on. Now place it into level. Um, now I'm going to drag something that is hidden in the tool toolbar. Um, you will find it as a database view. Click it. Go under particles. Now I've already uploaded them. But what you do is to upload the load library. And you'll find everything there. So I've chosen like stuff like waterfall, smoke file, and many other things. Actually, I can't open it up again, so. Under there and C CXP waterfall and there's a range of things you can use I'm going to select one of them there's also a different par parameters to change around with like making it continuous or not like yeah so um, once you've chosen which one you want, right click it and uh, assign to selected objects. Make sure that the object is selected as well. And as you can see it's appeared into the level, it's floating, but <laughs> yeah. I'll move it a bit. Yeah. And just right now I'm just copy and pasting it, placing a different angles, make sure follow terrain is placed on but it's still a bit missed out place just placing it even more now I'm just choosing another type of particle effect just making it look like it's actually Cladding with water on. Yeah, just make sure that you go at, uh, at different angles so that you see that doesn't float. So yeah, right now I'm just showing you another different particle effect. I'm gonna just copy and paste that and just drag it somewhere else. Yeah, as, as you can see, it was just going through the terrain there. Just make sure that's it. So yeah, now I'm just clicking, just seeing different effects in the smoke and fire loadout. Yeah. See, so create fire particles, not just that like, water particles. Yeah, and you know, each particle has a different effect. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching, and there are more videos to watch.